Are you gonna go out? Huh? I just opened the door up so the snakes can go out. The black cord in the back is just my cable line running behind the boa cage that goes over to my television, but yeah. I just opened up their door. You're gonna go out and check it out? I put a new double wide wet and dry heating pad in there for you for nights so you don't have to worry about coming back in at night. And you got two really big heat bulbs out there. So you guys are set for the night. So if it gets cold at night, you can stay out there. Nosey's going out. Yay, she opened our door finally. They've been sitting here with their chins on this door for the better part of three weeks because they know when I usually open it up for them. My nosey's on her way out. I had somebody ask me if I would record it while they're going out, so. He's caught nosy. Grumpy's still upstairs, scrounging for food, what he does best. But he'll be down a little while when he realizes nosy's missing. It's nosy going out into their 13 foot glass enclosure. She's getting some really unique rust color uh, patterns on her that she never had before. But it's nosy going outside. Ruffy's upstairs going, where's my girlfriend? Where's my girlfriend? She's running away and leaving you. But after they're both out, I'll go outside and get some videos of them outdoors in their enclosure. This is Nosy on her way out. They've been bugging me for three weeks to go out there. And I have to have everything just so in the event that they don't want to come in at night. So I know they're safe if they're outdoors in their enclosure. But now I've got heat set up and I've got big heat bulbs set up so they'll be fine out there at night. Nosey's still traveling. She moves slow sometimes, but boy, when she strikes, you'd never know she's as big and heavy as she is. She can really lay a while up on something. Believe me, I know I've been on the receiving end. <laughs> when she had my entire forearm in her mouth a couple of years ago, I never want to do that again. But that was my own fault, so yeah, can't blame the snake for it. Uh, Nosey's on her way out. Not much left, just your tail end. But after Grumpy comes down and goes out, he'll know she's missing now a little while and start looking for her and see the doors open and he'll go out too. I'll record some later after they go out. Hey Grumpy, your girlfriend's already outdoors in your other cage. Maybe you should stop staring at the ceiling and go down the stairs and go out and join her. Grumpy's like, where'd my girlfriend go? <laughs> this is Nosy. This is her double wide wet and dry heating pad I just put out here this morning. So if they want to stay out at night, they'll be nice and dry. She's heading down to the other end. Open the door. Here goes Nosy. Here goes Miss Nosy. But yeah, this is her double white wet and dry heating pad that I just installed this morning. So I can leave it, plug it in at night, and they can stay out here at night if they want to. But yeah, she's a big girl. This is Nosy. Sorry about the grunt and I'm holding the outside door up with my shoulder. <laughs> it's kind of hard to do. That's my big girl. That's my big girl, huh? That's my girl. That's my nosy, huh? I still got to do some cosmetic work. I'm taking this nylon uh, screen down and putting an aluminum screen up next week. But they've been bugging me to come out. So I just let them come out before I did the cosmetic work on it. But... All this is going to be replaced with nylon, I mean with uh, aluminum screen. The nylon works and they're less likely to rub their noses on it, which I like the, like it for that reason, but I don't like the way it looks. So I'm going to replace it with aluminum screen. What are you doing? Huh? Yeah, this is nosy. Grumpy hasn't figured out the doors open yet, so he's still indoors. 
I didn't change anything in your doorway, silly. The only thing I changed was outside. Big girl. She's a big girl. That stubby tail. Look at that stubby tail. Huh, that stubby tail. Isn't that cute? Isn't that cute? So why are you playing with my tail, Mama? <laughs> what are you looking at? What'd you find? Huh? What'd you find? I didn't change anything except to put a different lock on the door. That's the only thing that changed. She's so curious about everything. And she notices every little thing. I've seen her sit for hours staring up in the corner of her cage on the top floor. And I'm like, what are you looking at? And something as minute as a little teeny piece of dust that the air current's moving around. She'll sit for hours staring at it. You're breathing awful hard. Why are you breathing so hard? Her throat's going in and out. It's not warm out here, silly. Yeah, it's nosy. Hey, you going back in or you staying out? Actually, she's just sniffing everything. That's why her throat's going in and out. Hey, nosy, nosy. Book and stricter oxygen tablets. Hey, hey. <laughs> Hey, hey, hey. Come say hi. Come say hi. What? 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 So I'm checking everything out. Leave me alone. You're tasting everything in that doorway. Nobody's been in it but you and Grumpy, I promise. Yeah. Surprised Grumpy hasn't come down yet. Where's your Grumpy? Where's your Grump? This, uh, I built it on this side of the house because the the sun that hits on this side is late in the day, so it's not really all that hot out here for him. But, uh, so part of the cage is shaded and part of it's not. Sorry she looks a little weird, but it's the lighting out here. The sun's bouncing off the glass on top. Their patterns are hard to catch anyway, but when the light reflects off them. Hi, Nosy! Hi, Nosy! What are you doing? What are you doing? Hey, 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 come on out. Come say hi. Come say hi. Come on out and be sociable. Oh. What? What? That's why I discourage people from feeding their snakes live. She's got a little lump on her nose right there. When I used to feed live, she bit one of the rats, a colossal rat by bottom jaw, and the top teeth came down on top of her nose. She went to two different vets, and they said it wasn't anything to be concerned about. It's not a threat to her health, but it left one little teeny lump there of scar tissue on her nose. It's just a little teeny bump, but... It really bothers me that I could have prevented that from happening, so I really try to discourage people from feeding their snakes live feeders. No, you're not coming out the door. Give it up. It only shows from a certain angle. Where are you going? Where are you going? Huh? Where are you going? Get my nosy. Get my nosy. Where are you going? Huh? What are you doing? What's up? What are you doing? So it's pretty cool, Ma. You got fixed up pretty nice. You can sleep out here tonight, too, you know. Wanna sleep out? Huh? You sleep out tonight? Hi, Nosy. Hi, Nosy. <laughs> Say, quit bothering me. See, stop it. She's big. She's really a big girl. She's not a bad snake at all. So I'm not a bad snake. So you better leave me alone. I'm trying to check everything out and see what you did different. Now these are my big babies. I call them my general giants because they really are. For their size, they're just total sweethearts. But they've been handled a lot and worked with a lot. That makes a big difference. Hi, Nose. Did I freak you out? I'm sorry. I talk to them like they're my kids because they are my kids. I've raised them. I work with them, I support them, I take care of them, I clean up after them. 
I love them to death and I respect them. And yeah, so they're my kids in a sense. Aren't you? So yes, we are. Yes, we are. See, we're her kids. Hey, look at your tail. Can I have your tail? Can I have your tail? Did you be nosy? She's a big girl. Come here. Why don't you come visit? What are you doing way down there? Huh? Come see me. So, nope. Checking everything out. I know he's out. Grumpy just hasn't made it out yet. I'm sure he will be before the day's over. Like I said, that's how she got her name. She's the first one to investigate everything. Grumpy's the one that talks all the time. No, you can't come out. No. No out. No out. You can't come out the big door. And yes, they all respond to hand commands and nose taps. Just a very light tap in the back up. Get your big I'm a good girl. Relax. Isn't it? Yeah. I know my mama loves me. Yes, she does. Huh. Mama loves nosy. You can't come out this door. I'm sorry. Who can come out this door? No, you can't. No, you can't. You keep right on trucking. So I'm a big girl. You slowly see my hand disappear because of her size. <laughs> it takes two to three people to take each one of these outdoors into the yard because of their size. They're 11 feet now and she's well over 100 pounds. Said, but I love my mama. Yes, I do. Nosey loves her mama. Huh. So yes, I do. Very proud of them. Beautiful animals. Where are you going? Going to play in your water dish? That's a lot of snake. See, so yeah, I'm a lot of snake. She's my girl. Nosey's my girlfriend, huh? Don't get a drink. Wait for Grumpy to stray himself down here. Getting a drink or are you going to get in it and play in it? Neither one would surprise me, actually. And you stay out of that corner. I had to pack an afghan back there so they can't get in the corner behind it at night. They stay out. Last thing I want them doing is being somewhere where the heat can't get to them. Now she's looking out the window. No birds yet today, nosy. They love chasing the birds going by the windows out here. Yeah. This uh, water dish is just temporary set up. The pool's right underneath her, right about here. But it's too cold at night to set the pool up yet. Probably, hopefully next month if we'll quit, quit getting cold nights and thunderstorms, I'll be able to start her pool going. But yeah, she's getting a drink. They love it out here. Grumpy, you coming out? He's probably up on the top floor sleeping, lazy bum. He'll come out though, I turned the air conditioner off, so he'll be out here. Oh, yep, this is my girlfriend. This is my girlfriend. Pretty girl. That stubby tail. I'm gonna get your tail. She's drinking away. She real pretty patterns. They still got like a little pink coloring on their belly. She'll be shedding pretty soon. That's why she's so dark. But I love that shine. They always look like that. That's healthy snakes. That's healthy snakes. So here we are. Mama's bodyguards. 
Yeah, they are. I had Grumpy chase a guy in the yard a couple of years ago. The guy actually peed on himself. Grumpy scared him so bad. Actually, Grumpy scared me because we had him out in the yard, him a nosy, and guy got came walking up the driveway because he ran out of gas. He up the road from my house and he came walking in the driveway and Grumpy stood up in there, hit the ground and took off like a bullet after the guy right behind his heels. The guy's running down my driveway screaming and yelling, but I, that's the only time I can honestly say I've ever been concerned was because that guy walked up to us outdoors while we had the snakes out and Grumpy wasn't familiar, neither one of them were familiar with the guy and he stood right up and went after that guy. I don't know if the poor guy ever got any gas or not because he sure as heck didn't come back in my yard but it, that was one incident I can say really concerned me because I'd never seen Grumpy do that, react to someone that he didn't know like that before. This outdoor enclosure sealed up really nice. There's very little chance of water getting into it. I've never had a problem with it. but. Uh, yeah. She's happy. I think Grumpy forgot about you. Where's Grumpy Grump? Where's Grumpy? Hmm? Where's your Grump? That's my girl. That's my girl. See, yep, I'm a mama's girl. Can't wait till I can open their pool and sprinkler up. No birds flying by today yet, Nose. <laughs>